So in this video, I'm comparing two products, uh, two live-in products. I've been using this one from L'Oreal Botanicals. Uh, it's a very good cream, no build up at all. I have low porosity hair, so my hair is prone to build up and it doesn't really like to have um, products applied to dry hair. But this one I've been applying to dry hair. It's on my between wash days. Um, it's how I, how I style my hair. Um, and, and it doesn't create, I mean, after a week of applying it every day, you do have buildup, but by then it's also time to wash your hair. So it's okay. Um, but for a day to day basis, I like it a lot. And since I have bleach hair, just my ends are bleached, uh, since from, from old stupid things I've done to my hair. Um, I wanted to, and I dry my roots, my gray hair with cassia. Um, and I wanted to make a more natural transition between my ends and my um, and my roots. I decided to try this one. Uh, it's from Ask, uh, or I think it's Ask that you say it's a blue blue chamomile, and it's a spray. So this one from L'Oreal is a cream, and this one is a spray. And it's supposed to add shine to the hair, help lighten it a little when you have a natural blonde or bleached hair. And it's supposed also to soften it. Uh, that's the reason I bought it actually, because I don't uh, like using uh, products that make my hair dry. I wanted the product that softened it, uh, that moisturizes my hair. But at the same time, I was willing to try this one, considering that uh, it would theoretically lighten my hair. I only used it for two days, so I can't really say if it did lighten my hair or not. Uh, I don't think there was any effect for now, uh, but um, I can tell that it made my hair drier. I will now show you my hair. On, on this side of my hair, I applied the Ask Blue Chamomile Spray, and on this side of my hair, I applied the, um, the, the one from L'Oreal Botanicals, the cream. And uh, in terms of uh, curl definition, if you can call my wavy hair curly, uh, so in terms of definition or uh, anything else, I don't see any difference between the two, but I can feel it. So on this side where I apply the spray, um, I do notice that the hair is drier and feels therefore dirtier than on this side where it feels more moisturized and even though I can feel it with my fingers a little bit of product buildup, uh, it's very unnoticeable. Uh, whereas here I really feel dry. So it's not really about, about the product buildup, it's really the dryness. Uh, my hair does not like to be, um, so uh, for instance, there are many people that just mix water with conditioner and apply it to their hair. I cannot do that to my hair. My hair does not like water unless I'm going to wash it. Uh, so if I just wet my hair um, and then I apply a conditioner, it's not enough because since I have low porosity hair, it's, the water is not enough to remove buildup. And uh, adding water and then on top of it more buildup, the hair doesn't like it at all. Whereas in cream form, from, for some reason, it helps the, the hair absorb it or at least it doesn't dry it up. I don't know how to explain it uh, scientifically. I just know that uh, my hair does not really like to be sprayed with stuff. So cream is okay, not all cream. So far this is the only cream I can use, uh, but not the spray.